Welcome back to Tim and Unboxing. Hello, and today we are unboxing Toy USA's Damaged Mystery Box. Yeah, so this was like the Beat the Heat edition. I'm not exactly sure what that means, but it was released August 27th. So it was $80 per box. Each box has four tops in it. Um, so we only got one box, and total after shipping was $90.54. And the guaranteed value is $75. So hopefully we get something good. Usually with Toy USA damaged mystery boxes, I've seen a lot of videos based on it. Um, they're usually not that damaged. Most of them are probably mint or maybe mm -hmm. like an 8 out of 10. Yeah. Um, but they kind of do these boxes to get rid of ones that might have like minor scuffs that they can't do in regular ones. Mm -hmm. Because people feel like, hey, this isn't cool. It's scuffed. Yeah. So Give me my money back. It's probably going to be pretty decent. Um, we might be able to hit something good. I don't know what the top grails are, but... That would be cool if we, we got something yeah. real cool. Yeah, it definitely would be. Before we open up this box, though, <laughs> make sure to leave a comment down below telling us your favorite Funko Pop that we unbox today. Let's see what's inside. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's called Beat the Heat because it's like the last summer box. Maybe. I don't know. Somebody put me in it says it's like a scavenger hunt, which is like weird wording to put in the mystery box. Cause like, yeah. It's a mystery box. How can you hunt for that? Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Unless you just buy every single box. Um, I don't know if they're in protectors or not. We're just going to have to see. <laughs> yep. We will see. All right. So Fragile. Please handle with care. Thank you. <laughs> asterisk, asterisk. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully these come in the boxes. They do not come in the boxes. Okay. Anyway, so... Plastic wrap off first. Yeah. Can you, can you, is it easy to get off? Um, we can take it off that plastic wrap and just rip it up the entire box. Oh boy. Can you like rip the bubble wrap and. Oh, look. <laughs> oh, no. That's too small. Uh, um, okay. Out. Any protectors? Is that a protector? No, it's not. It's all for like straight up box. Straight up box. <laughs> Here it is. All right. Straight box. So we don't know which one's more valuable. We're just going to pick them out randomly. Mm -hmm. So you pick out the first one? Yep. Show the people. The first box. Oh, that is backward. I feel like I saw the color, which might give me a hint to what franchise. I don't know, but. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. You All ready right. to look? Yep. All right. No, but I was, oh! I, no, I, I was technically right. I saw the yellow. It's Prison Mike from The Office. Like a basic man. <laughs> I love The Office. All it's right, a hilarious so show. With this box, we definitely have to check for damage. Yeah. Because this is a damage mystery box. There are some at the top, I think. There's, there's some at the top. I'm trying to see if there's any other one. So... It's slight scuff here. I mean, honestly, I don't know if that's like was there before they boxed it because it honestly could have happened during shipping. Yeah. I have no idea, but I mean, it's just a minor thing. It's nothing too crazy. It's a Hot Topic exclusive. It does actually have the sticker, which is nice because I've I've noticed with a lot of these mystery boxes, yeah, like, they just have the but we don't yeah. Which exclusive those is. those stickers are called like the overseas stickers. They mm -hmm. get restocked overseas. Mm -hmm. Um, which is part of the reason why they aren't as valuable because they mm. got restocked, you know, they're not as limited. But this actually has the Hot Topic sticker, so that's pretty cool. Yeah. Pretty cool. Um, Funko Pop. Yeah. All right. And this is a newer one, I'm pretty sure. This Prison Mike one. Oh, my God. It has a sticker on it. On the barcode, this annoys me. Please, Please places yeah. that sell Funko Pop. Stop doing that. <laughs> this is easy to, to search up, I guess. You know exactly yeah. which version it is. Yeah, I know what it is. All right. Uh, Take out the next one. You ready? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's the back. This is, yeah, this is correct. So hopefully it's good. Are right, you ready, Luke? Mm-hmm. All right. The Pillsbury Doughboy. Oh, this is the Funko Shop Limited Edition. This is the one with the, um, the, like, uh, Easter eggs. This is <laughs> actually, like, the... Probably the least valuable Pillsbury, I'm pretty sure. Okay. But. I like the Pillsbury Doughboy. Yeah. So positive. Helps you bake cookies and stuff like that. 
And those cookies are pretty good. Yeah, then when you poke them, you go. To- <laughs> 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 so this box, um, it has very very minor scuffs. I'm not even sure if you can see them in there, but like inside in these places, there's like some minor scuffs. There's also a minor scuff on the edge here. Nothing too crazy. Um, but other than that, it's pretty decent. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe like a give it like a nine. Is probably what I'll give it. Like the prison might probably be more like an eight point five, just because that's like way more noticeable. Yeah. And this might be like a nine. Still, right. still pretty good though. All right, next All right. pop. Next pop. All right, I feel like I saw what it was. Oh my god. That's tough. We'll what see. What is though. it? Is it good? Hopefully. Hopefully. We'll see. All right, right let's see. look. Mm-hmm. Nope, I was wrong. I thought it was the oh, Luke. Edgar. I thought it was the Luke Skywalker one where he has Yoda on his back because I saw the hair in the face like that. That would be cool. Yeah, I really like that one. What is this? This is Edgar from Men in Black. Oh, I do not remember Men in Black. I, I'm yeah, going to be tough. quite honest. Cool though. It's pretty cool though. Yeah. Love Will Smith, Tommy Lee Jones is cool too. I guess. <laughs> I have. I've never seen this pop actually. Yeah, I didn't think that would be a pop. Yeah. Um, the box bulges out a little bit. Um, mm-hmm. Not really too big of an issue. Um, this has a couple scuffs and a couple corners. Yeah. Might give it like a a 9. It's nothing too crazy. 9 or 8.5 at low, lowest point. Nothing wild. All right. So you said that this might be in the pop protector. Yeah. So this might be our biggest hit then. So pull it out and show the people first, which, oh yeah, this isn't a pop protector. Well, this is the top. Is this the back? I have no idea. I'm just going to turn around for you guys because I have no idea what's like to talk about. It might be, you know, it might be. Pretty sure this is the bottom though, but I don't know. All right, you ready to look? Yep. All right. Oh, Madame Leota. And this is the glow in the dark one. This is actually a pretty decent hit. Um, I don't know. I don't remember exactly how much it is, but this is a pretty decent hit. It actually is. Yeah. So, is why is it so dark right now? I don't know. This is a dark top, <laughs> though. It's, like, really dark in the back. Yeah. <laughs> it's just so, like, dark. It's hard to see in there. Um, But, yeah, this is actually a decent hit. I'm actually happy with this. Um, I, Again, I don't remember how much it was. It might be, like, it might be 50, honestly. It oh, might be nice. 50. Our guarantee value is what, 75? We'll see. Mm-hmm. That might be 50. I don't know. All right. Now I need to check the prices on these. So we pull a prison mic out. Oh, I forgot to check the. Let's see. There's like a weird streak on this, but mm-hmm. this does have the Disney Park exclusive sticker too. Nice. It's pretty cool. And it glows in the dark. Mm hmm. <laughs> There's like a slight scuff here. There's a manufacturing error there that I see on a lot of pops for whatever reason. Yeah. Um, but I mean, it's, it's honestly like a 9.5. It's mm-hmm. pretty good. But all right. Um, right. We're going to use the Funko app. If it pictures a pop that has a different sticker, then we'll use Pop Price Guy because most of these have stickers. So we'll see. But we'll use Pop Price Guy to start off just because it's faster. So all right. Prison Mike, how much do you think he's going for? Probably 12. 12? Yeah, yeah. I, I don't think he's like the most valuable office one. My personal but favorite, but probably not worth much. I'm going to say 15. 15? Oh, I can't use Funko Apple on this one because that's a sticker. I can't use the barcode, so. Tough. Pop price guy, here we go. All right. Prison Mike. Prison Mike. So I said 15, you said 12. Mm-hmm. He is going for 22. Okay. That's actually pretty decent. Yeah. So he's going for $22. Never underestimate Steve Carell. <laughs> I love Steve Carell. He's a funny man. He is. All right. So feels very do- doughboy. I think he's like 15 or 20. I don't know which one I want to say. I'm going to say 15. What do you say? Give that boy 20. 20? Mm-hmm. All right. We're going to use the Funko app this time because, again, it's faster. I know he's like the least valuable Fillsbury. So he is $14. $14. Yeah. So the other Fillsbury, because ad icons are they usually do pretty well. So those ones are more expensive, but I know they're like Funko Shop exclusive um, with the Easter basket. I knew that was lower. 
I actually knew that one off the top of my head. Off the dome? Mm-hmm. <laughs> so that was 14. We're currently at 36, and we have to reach 75. So next, Edgar, what are you thinking? $6. Yeah, I feel like, because I mean, I've never seen this. It looked like it might have came out. I can't tell if this is like... 2019 or 2016 i can't tell the format of that mm -hmm. but um gotta search it up in the pop price guide uh it has a sticker on it i i do tough so let's see edgar he is seven seventeen. wait what did you say your guess was six six um i'm gonna say 10 mm. i don't think he's gonna be that much honestly but let's see Edgar is 10. He's ten dollars is that? Precisely. Yeah, so we are currently at forty-six dollars. Meaning this Madame Leota has to be what do we have to do? 75. Mm -hmm. So it has to be like somewhere between 20 and 30 at least. Um yeah. but I feel like she's I've seen this so many times. I think she's like 40 or 50. So I'm gonna say I'm gonna say 40. No, I'm gonna say 45. I was going to say 46. 46? Mm. All right. Well, we can scan her because she doesn't have a sticker with her barcode. <laughs> so if we look at this, it is not scanning. Probably because it's in the pop protector. Oh, my God. Okay, we're just going to go to Pop Price Guy again <laughs> and look up Madam Leota. Do you like the Hunt Imagine? Mm, it was cool. Is there only one kind of Hunt Imagine? Because all I know is the Eddie Murphy one. Is there a different kind? Was the Eddie Murphy one a remake? I have no there idea. Makes, actually. There are probably a number of like, remakes and sequels to it. Okay. Well, the only one I know of is the Eddie Murphy one. Mm -hmm. So, all right. Madame Leota. Let's find her. She's $19? And she's depreciated like $6. That's tough. Recently. But it's so weird because... This is the glow in the dark version. And the regular version is $30. I, wait. That's kind of crazy. Let's let's look at this just a little bit closer. Yeah, it's it's $19. What in the world? How is the glow in the dark exclusive sticker version less than just the normal one? That's hilarious. $19? What? That is terrible. Low key. So we only got 65. Mm. Oh my God. That is so disappointing. I thought this <laughs> was more. Wow. No value in Disney. Yeah. And she was the only one to pop protect her. And she actually cost the least. Well, she did go down. And what was it? $9? $6. $6. So technically she would have been a little more than prison Mike. But <laughs> wow, that is so disappointing. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> well, favorite pop? Prison Mike. Prison Mike? Mm -hmm. Um, I don't know. My favorite might be the Fillsbury. Might be the Fillsbury. A very close second for me. Mm -hmm. Gotta love the Fillsbury Dope Boy. All right, so. It's legend. Review time. It is review time. You want to go first? Sure. Um, I mean, these are decent pops. Um, as far as the franchises go, and as far as, like, how popular they are, I've seen Madame Leota a lot. Prison Mike, I know, is well loved. And Phil's very doable is real loved. Edgar, I feel like, is probably nobody wants him, honestly. Yeah, very obscure. Yeah, it just seems so random, because if you look on the back, there's only, like, two other ones in the collection, and it's the yeah. main characters. Yeah. So it's weird that it's, it's just, text. like, him. Yeah, so. <laughs> I don't know, but. So this is Toy USA. This is actually our first Toy, Toy USA box. So I'm going to yeah it is. We haven't done Toy USA um before. Oh. So yeah. I'm gonna give it a seven because we didn't quite meet our value. Yeah. I mean, Madame Leota did go down in what was it, six dollars? Yeah. She did go down in six dollars, which I mean still wouldn't put us <laughs> there though. But you know, this did come out, what was it, eight twenty seven? Today it is September 4th, so it could have, you know, went down a couple of dollars. 
times be changing on the Yeah, it happens. Or at least I'm hoping that's the reason. So mm. we spent ninety dollars and only got sixty five. Yikes. That is kind of bad. You know, I'm changing my score to six. I'm changing it to a six. Seven yeah. to six. What are you giving it? I I like most of the pops, mm-hmm. but Still paying ninety, only getting sixty five yeah. in value back. That and they're damage boxes, so yeah. you technically have to take a couple dollars off more. Yeah, that's not very, <laughs> that's not very cash money of twenty yeah. USA. So um, I'll probably also have to go with a six, six out of ten. Kind of low, Tough. but you know that's how it is. That's the game. That's the mystery box game. True, but now that we have unboxed everything for this video. If you enjoy any of the pops that you saw us um, receive, I have a gaming channel always linked in the description down below where every time I reach a milestone, I'll do giveaways. So you might get one of these pops in your own collection. Very nice. That's going to be all for today's video. Make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below telling us your favorite pop that we unboxed today. And do you think this box is worth it or not? Probably not for this one. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.